Why did the early Methodists multiply and grow so rapidly? Canadian Methodist W.S. Blackstock answers, It was said of the early Methodists that they were all at it and always at it. The aim of our fathers was, as far as possible, to leave no talent unemployed. They provided a place of usefulness for everyone and sought to prepare everyone for his place. If a man could preach in such a way as to awaken sinners and lead them to the Savior, they made a local preacher of him. If he could not preach but had the gift of exhortation, they appointed him to the office of an exhorter. When he could neither preach nor exhort publicly but, if he had the necessary gifts and graces, they made a class leader or a prayer leader of him. And when he was unable to take any official position, they put him under the leadership of another and encouraged him to do all that he could to bring those who had been his associates and companions to Christ. In other words, as a fellow Canadian put it, they were a church that has given the widest scope to lay agency and lay preaching. They believed in every man and woman exercising every gift which God had endowed them for the edification of the church and the glory of God.